this is a critical point. The hackers did not defeat a firewall. They defeated a person. Arup's global CIO, Rob Grieg, aptly named it Technology Enhanced Social Engineering, expressed hope that his company's story would raise awareness about this new class of threat. Hong Kong police later revealed that these criminal operations often use stolen identity cards to open up the Mule bank accounts for these kinds of heists. In some cases, deep fakes have even been used to fool a bank's own facial recognition systems during account verification. Showing how this was just one part of a larger, more complex web of AI-powered crime. The Arup heist is a landmark event. It proves that deepfake technology is no longer a novelty for internet memes. It is a proven and potent weapon for cyber criminals. As AI tools become more accessible and powerful, these attacks are set to become more and more